Got an ugly countertop somewhere in your house? I've got a great and easy solution. This was our bathroom before, cream tile with cartoon character, tropical fish, just everything about the room was bland, blah, and boring. It didn't feel anything at all like us, no personality. So we decided that concrete countertops would be a great place to start. Any surface that you're experimenting with, just make sure you do a little fine sanding first, kind of work up a little tooth on whatever it is. I mean, this was ceramic tile. Um, same with Formica though, just, you know, just do a little bit of sanding. I'll give you a supply list at the end of the video, but here are a few really good tips. When you mix the concrete, make it like pancake batter. And when you put it on, put it on very, very thinly, each coat, and sand between each very dry coat. We waited about four hours between each. So regardless of the surface, um, we found that a trowel and a paintbrush and some fine sandpaper and a wet sponge were our best tools. So when we were done with the concrete part, then we you knew we had to seal it. So we used uh, a concrete sealer and we did four thin coats of that as well, just to protect the surface. Um, it gives it sort of a nice, um, satiny look, nothing, we didn't want anything too shiny, we just wanted a modern, clean kind of feel. And then naturally I had to attack the walls with some fun, quick painting. Don't let the idea of this project intimidate you. It's just one of those gather your guts up and go for it kind of projects. Because details matter, we topped off this wall with a wonderful charred stick. Literally, John got this out of our yard, charred it with a torch, and then sealed it with acrylic sealant. And then we spray painted these gold, So in the end, the whole project took us approximately three days, which is actually really amazing considering the incredible transformation. <laughs>